Well, hello everybody and welcome to the November 10th, 2015 edition of the Clint Dog Johnson Daily Vlogs. It's a Tuesday evening and I am recording this from Philadelphia Hall in the computer lab. This morning I started out like right when the day started watching some of the ESPN 30 for 30 show at the gospel according to that about... Uh, Bill McCartney, the guy who founded Promise Keepers, and he was a college football coach at the University of Colorado. Uh, interesting stuff on it. His uh, quarterback had a baby with uh, his daughter, and actually a defensive player did too as well. Sal Honesty and uh, Shannon Clavel. Uh, but then Sal Honesty, Sal Onessi, I think it's Onessi is how you say it. Uh, he ended up dying of this like stomach cancer. So it was kind of interesting just to watch about that. And it talked about how the university, you know, it wasn't really a, a school for black people that much back then. Golden wasn't really a black people's town. But, you know, as, as Bill and Cartney recruited all the stud athletes, and, you know, I think they finally became a little bit more accepting of that. And uh, he hired, like, a prof who was an advisor. Um on that kind of stuff uh, to help with that. So it was just an interesting uh, show. I didn't watch all of it because I'm ADHD. But then I hung out in my room for a while before going to bed. And I actually woke up an hour before work started. You never want to do that, especially if you're Clint Johnson. Uh, yeah, I made it to work on time, but it wasn't easy. And I don't recommend ever being that late to anything or being that late waking up for anything. Because it's not a good thing to do. Um, let's see, after that, I just uh, worked and then went home to my house for a little bit. And then at 8 o'clock, I went out to Walmart to walk around with the uh, road out there with Jared Mitzelfeld and his fiance, Samantha Sam Johnson. And uh, so we did that. And now I'm back here in Uh I got a brownie and just surfing the web until I walk home. So, yeah, kind of a, just a plain Jane day, but also a good day because I got out to Walmart and I watched some good things on the internet and it was a lot of fun. So, hope you had a great day.